Hey, what's up? The Preston 13 here, and we are going to open some 2019 Tops opening day boxes. We'll take a quick look at the box here. Get one down close for you. Before we get started, I just want to say I appreciate you guys hanging out. Anything you want to talk about, throw it in the chat box there. Uh, I'll do my best to move quickly. If you like these videos, you can check me out. I'm on Twitter at Preston underscore sports. I will typically post there before we go live on these things. We'll go ahead and get all our packs out and ready. So you're looking at 16 packs plus one exclusive pack of red parallel cards in each box. And this is what your red parallel package looks like. And then the rest of these guys, seven cards per pack. We'll get these lined up and ready to go. What do you say? Well, we'll save the exclusives for the end. What do you think? Been having a whole lot of fun with these openings. In our very first one, we were just some football cards. Got an awesome Patrick Mahomes jersey card. And then uh, we did some Bowman Chromes. We got some excellent Chrome cards. Always beautiful, those Bowman Chromes. We had, uh, what else did we do? We did some other stuff. It's on the channel there if you want to check it out. We've had some pretty decent luck. A really nice Eloy Jimenez chrome card in the last one. A couple autographs, or one autograph and a couple, to, a couple numbered cards. Goodness, get off of there. Let's go. All right. We got our three boxes open here. Sorry about the delay there, folks. Had to grab something real quick. And we are back up and running here. So we're going to get started with our first pack. We'll set our three parallel packs aside for now. We'll throw them in the back. We'll get to them eventually. And let's see what we get here. Jaime Barrera. Pretty good looking cards. Kind of an old school feel. Nothing, uh, no big bells or whistles. Nothing extravagant. Aaron Nola with the Phillies. Mookie Betts with the White Sox. Scoop these up a little bit. A hundred years of fun, Frank Thomas. German Mar Marquez with the Rockies. Garrett Cole with Houston and Lords Gary L. Jr. with the Blue Jays. Masahiro Tanaka with the Yankees. Good looking card. I like that one. 
Kyle Schwarber, Chicago. Carlos Martinez, the Rangers mascot. Eugenio Suarez, excellent young player for Cincinnati. Shane Bieber with the Indians and Michael Franco. Pack number three. Corey Kluber. Chu Sin Su with the Rangers now. And there we go. There's Mike Trout. Always fun to pull a Mike Trout. That dude is an absolute beast. There's not a lot of base cards we'll pull out. Mike Trout's going to be one of them. 100 years of fun. 150, I'm sorry. Hank Aaron. Hammer and Hank. We're going to put him in the pile with the big hurt there. Corey Seager. Jeff McNeil. And James Paxton. So we got a Mike Trout out of that pack. Who doesn't love Mike Trout? Ahmed Rosario. Brad Boxberger. Starlin Marte. And what do we got here? San Diego. Team Traditions and Celebrations, Tony Gwynn statue outside of San Diego's park. What is that, Petco Park? No, I can't remember. That's a good card. Tony Gwynn, one of my absolute favorite players growing up. If you don't know much about him, Google him up. One of the best hitters of the baseball ever. Jorge Polanco, Noah Snyder guard, and Justin Smoke. Going to round out that pack. We got the Tony Gwynn statue there. That's a personal favorite of mine. That's nice. Might have hit 400 if it weren't for that strike. Cedric Mullins. Hunter Renfro. Avisail Garcia. And another 150 years of baseball. This one's Gary Carter. This one has him in an Expos uniform. Jameson Talion. Derek Dietrich. Uh, that's got him in a Marlins, Marlins outfit. He is actually with Cincinnati now. And Nicholas Castellanos in Detroit. All right. So nothing crazy yet. A couple nice... Uh, 150 year celebration cards. I see a little something peeking in the back there. Might make our Yankee fans happy. Matt Carpenter. Edwin Encarnacio, now with the Mariners. Joey Gallo. And Screech, the Washington mascot. Screech. We got David Price, Max Scherzer, and then they've got Aaron Judge. Told you we had something coming for the Yankee fans there. Right, should, should we put them off the side with Trout, maybe? There's not a lot of base cards we're going to pull aside. Maybe we'll put Judge there. Excited to see how his career turns out. Got an incredible amount of talent, that's for sure. Jaimeer Candelario in Detroit. I do apologize if I butcher any of these names too badly. Feel free to leave me a comment if uh, you want to correct me. I'll do my best. Jack Flattery. Justin Turner. He just had a real good series against the Reds. And 150 years of fun, Nolan Ryan. Let's get a good look at him. That's a good card. Love me some Nolan Ryan. 
Trevor Story, Alex Gordon, and Jesse Aguilar. Nolan Ryan threw seven no-hitters, I believe, in his career. And uh, these days, I don't know if uh, your good pitchers are getting seven shutouts in their career. If you never watched any tape on Nolan Ryan, all you young kids out there, I suggest you look him up on YouTube. Had some phenomenal stuff. Jacob DeGrom, incredibly talented young man in New York. Brian Anderson and Anthony Rizzo. And we got an opening day card, Toronto Blue Jays. Kyle Gibson, Freddie Freeman with Atlanta, and there's a rated rookie for us. I think that's the first one we've come across. That's Willie Adams in Tampa Bay. They have a lot of good young talent. In Tampa Bay, they always seem to have a lot of good talent down there. Maybe, uh, maybe my Cincinnati Reds could get a few tips from what they're doing in Tampa Bay. I hear my dog barking in the background for a second. I do apologize. Mitch Haniger in Seattle, Raphael Devers, Brandon Crawford. And a Ty Cobb. How about that? An old Ty Cobb. Incredible with a baseball bat. Not so much with a toothbrush. Ty Cobb with a gnarly smile. If uh, Seriously, kids, if you don't know Ty Cobb, look him up. Maybe not the greatest human being in the world, but an incredible baseball player 100-something uh, years ago. Miguel Andujar. Andujar? I'm going to say Andujar. That's a tops rookie there. We're going to put him with Willie Adams. Joey Lucchesi. And Dakota Hudson. About halfway through this stack, I guess. Trey Mancini, Eric Cosmer with San Diego, Andrelton Simmons with the Angels. And we got something shiny here. Let's take a look at this. Lorenzo Cain with the Milwaukee Brewers. It's our first real insert. Those 150 years. I don't know if those really count. But that is a really pretty card. I hope you can see the blue sheen on it there. Not numbered or anything, but a very good looking card nonetheless. We're going to keep him separate from our 150 years. We'll put the true inserts up there. We got another mascot. It's Bernie Brewer. All the kids love the mascots. D. Gordon seems like he's been stealing bases in the league for 20 years. And speaking of 20 years, Evan Longoria been around about that long, it seems, too. All right, so we pulled a nice Lorenzo Kane out of that pack. Otherwise, nothing really to write home to mother about yet. But I have a feeling there's something good. Coming down the pike here. we got a long way to go. Matt Olson. Ronald Acuna Jr. Rookie card. Now that's a good one. Because this kid has an incredible amount of talent. I know everyone watching from Atlanta. Is keeping an eye on him. And Glaber Torres. Another rookie. Back to back there. Good pack there. 150 years of baseball. It's David Ortiz. Remember to eat your Wheaties, kids. Not little yellow or little chocolate donuts for breakfast. I'm sorry. Al led them. Mr. Diaz. 
Mr. Diaz, shortstop for Houston. There he is right there. And Billy Hamilton, incredibly fast. Got to get that on-base percentage up if he's going to utilize that speed. Jose Abreu brings us to the end of the pack. And let's keep going. Marty Brenneman's nodding approvingly in the background. If you don't know Marty, look him up. He's one of the best to ever do it. All right. Yoan Mancata. Young talent for the White Sox. Joey Wendell. JT Realmuto. Uh, and this one has him with the Marlins. He's still with the Marlins? They were able to hold on to him? No, no, no. Yeah, he ended up in Philadelphia. Sorry. A little brain fart there. He's a, he's a talented young kid, though. Team traditions and celebrations. Outfield pool. The Arizona Diamondbacks. We got Dansby Swanson with Atlanta. Andrew Benintendi. Benintendi. And Alex Bregman. We're going to have a nice mess to clean up after this. So once again, I forgot the garbage can. Brad Keller. Williams Astudio. Miguel Cabrera. He's a beast. In fact, we'll set him over here in the in the good standard pile. And then Ozzie Smith, 150 years of fun. Kids, if you don't know who Ozzie Smith is, Google him up. Um, some of the stuff he was doing at shortstop is pretty incredible. Wildly athletic guy. One hell of a baseball player. And if you like him, you might as well Google Barry Larkin, too. Kyle Freeland. And there's Bryce Harper. Uh, he's got about 2,300 games left on his contract, and he's off to a rough start in Philly. It'll be interesting to see how that plays out. And you, you say Kikuchi with Seattle. Yep, there. That's a rookie card, too. I snuck in at the top there. I almost missed it. So put that in uh, the rookie pile there. When you're opening packs at home, take your time. You don't want to miss anything. You never know. You might throw something into the pile that uh, you might want to set aside. Steven Strasburg. Nolan Arenado. We got Rowdy Telez. And uh, the Philly, the Philly Fanatic. And if I take a look, it looks like we almost skipped another rookie. They're snuck in there kind of kind of hard to see. Charlie Blackman, David Dahl, a couple of Colorado Rockies there, and then Matt Chapman. Two more packs left in this box. I'll give a quick shout out to my son, Nathan, helps me with some of this stuff. My buddy, Luke, also Lends a hand from time to time. Michael Lorenzen, good young arm for Cincinnati. Elvis Andrews, been around a long time. Clayton Kershaw, certainly one of the best arms in the league. No pitchers have made the uh, standard pile there. We'll put him up there. We got another 150 years of fun this time. It's Lou Gehrig. Sweet Lou Gehrig.
Michael Conforto, Todd Frazier, and Jonathan Villar. Todd Frazier is hoping to get back to his glory days. So are Mets fans. Albert Almora is going to start off the last pack there. Jonathan Shoup, Minnesota. Chris Bryant, off to a great start in Chicago. And another opening day card, this time at Cincinnati. So very good shot of Great American Ballpark. Sorry, can't seem to get that one in focus there. We got David Peralta, Edwin Diaz, and Mitch Garver to finish off that box. Let's move right on to the second one here. We want Dilly Dally. The kids still say Dilly Dally, right? Dilly Dally. Why not? Chris Davis. Pull these up a little closer here. Paul Goldschmidt. Riaz Hoskins. Reese Hoskins, pardon me. 150 years of fun. This one is Ken Griffey Jr. Cal Ripken Jr. My goodness. Something's wrong with me. It's getting late. Come on, buddy. Get the focus there for me. Be a good buddy. It's a good-looking card, Cal, Cal Ripken Jr., the Iron Man of baseball. Josh Hader in Milwaukee, Felipe Vazquez, and Tuki Toussaint. That's a rookie card. He's one of your top, uh, last time I looked, somewhere in the top 30, top 40 prospects in the league, Tuki Toussaint. My wife's uh, family's from Atlanta. And I know uh, a lot of them rooting for him down there. They always seem to have a lot of talent in Atlanta. Whether it uh, gets them in the playoff every year or not, they, they always seem to have a good young base down there. Dylan Bundy. Will Myers. And Wilson Contreras. We got another mascot, the Baltimore Orioles. Does he have a name? Is he just the Oriole? He's playing a the violin there. Jose Altuve, one of the most electrifying young players in the league. He's really fun to watch. I don't know that he's that young anymore. He's young to me. Louis Urias and Mike Clevenger. Nothing, nothing truly spectacular yet. It's going to be uh, interesting to see what we have in the other uh, packs, the exclusive packs, the parallels. Harrison Bader, rated rookie there. St. Louis. Carlos Carrasco. Take a look at Rugned Odor. We got another 150 years of fun, and it's Jim Palmer of the Baltimore Orioles. Those are good-looking cards. I do like them. And I certainly appreciate anything that keeps the young kids attached to the history of the game. It's important. Miles Mikolas, another St. Louis Cardinal. Ryan O'Hearn, another rated rookie. With Kansas City. And there we go. Shohei Otani. A rated rookie. An electrifying player. One of the funnest players to watch. The funnest? One of the more fun players to watch in the league. 
He pitches, he hits, he does everything. Let's take a look at the back. What's this guy doing? Into the rookie pile, and then we'll finish up with all we already talked about, Miles Nicholas, didn't we? Let's get another pack going here. So pulled a rated rookie Otani out of that one. That's awesome. We got Nico Goodrum starting off this pack. Sean Doolittle. Hoping to do a lot for Washington. <laughs> uh, dad jokes are great. Salvador Perez. And then what do we got here? We got another stadium card. Team Traditions and Celebrations. The Western Metal Building with the San Diego Padres. Always look like they're having a good time out there. We got Justice Sheffield with the Mariners. Tim Beckham over your Baltimore Orioles and Trevor Bauer up in Cleveland's going to round out that pack. I think Trevor Bauer still could be one of the better pitchers in the league for quite a while. He's always had some pretty good stuff. I don't know if he's ever really reached his potential. And it's Nick Martini. That's an excellent baseball player name, Nick Martini. Having a good time in Oakland. Starlin Castro. And we got another insert. This one's John Lester. It's our second shiny blue card. And I hope you can see it. Move it in the light there a little bit. Talk about a guy that's been around for a long time. Came into the league in 06 with the Red Sox. Was there for eight years. One in Oakland. And then uh, he's on his fourth or fifth year now in Chicago. We'll put him up there with Lorenzo Kane. And who do we got there? Sandy Koufax, the old left-hander. It could certainly be argued he's the best left-hander of all time. I'd tell you to take a look at Randy Johnson as well. Oh, come on, Sandy. Pull into focus. Sandy Koufax, kids. Look him up. Absolute stud. We got Kevin Gaussman. Blake Trinan. And Whit Merrifield. It's Jose Ramirez starting off this pack. We got Nomar Mazzara. And one of my favorite players in the league, Joey Votto. Off to a bit of a rough start this year, but we're putting him in the good pile. And it's another mascot, the Swinging Friar of San Diego. I can never uh, look at him and not think about Mel Brooks and uh, Robin Hood, Men and Thieves. Robin St. Cano has been an absolute stud forever. Back in New York with the other guys. Jose Barrios, I think he was our first card, wasn't he? One of our first cards out of the first pack. And Brandon Nemo. Kids, if you don't know who Mel Brooks is, if you've never seen a Mel Brooks movie, Google that up, too. Just keep the Google machine there next to you. I'll be telling you to Google stuff all night. Matt Duffy. Matt Davidson. Sorry, Jose Martinez. And another 50, 150 years. This one is... Ronald Acuna Jr. So they are including 
recent players in these. And we talked about him a few minutes ago. We'll put him in the 150 pile there. It's Michael Kopeck. Juan Soto rated rookie. I'm pretty sure he was a top 50 player. I'd have to have to take a second look. And Chris Archer. My dog is now playing in the garbage on the floor. So if you hear him wrestling around down there, I do apologize. It's Rick Porcello, Will Smith, Ozzy Albaez, and another opening day card. This time it is the New York Mets. It's Buster Posey. Sure thing. Going to walk off the field and straight into the Hall of Fame. No doubt about that. And just for fun, I'll put him in a good pile. Max Muncy in L.A. And Stephen Piscotti. Let's get something good. Let's get, let's get something good going on here. Something to write home about. It's Gregory Polanco. Albert Pujols, another guy that's going to walk straight into the Hall of Fame when he's done. Just a ridiculous hitter of the baseball. Sean Manea and 150 years. It's Ernie Banks. Absolute stud with Chicago Cubs. And I think somewhere around here I have an old Ernie Banks card. Not in great condition, but I got one. Fran Mel Reyes, Justin Verlander, God, he's been around forever, it seems, and Adjubel Herrera with your Philadelphia Philly. All right, it's Carlos Correa. Luis Severino, Severino, pardon me. Zach Godley. That's a good name for uh, anybody who plays professional sports, right? Godley. And the Pirate Parrot. It's Scooter Jeanette. I believe he's injured right now. Cincinnati's hoping to get him back soon. It's CNL Perez down in Houston. Eddie Rosario. And we're back to Carlos Correa. Now, see, I read a lot of these names, and I don't often hear them, especially guys in the American League. So I do apologize. I know I'm getting some of them horribly wrong. I just have to be. But uh, know that it's not intentional, and uh, I'll do my best to fix those things in the future. All right, who do we got next? It's Jake Arrieta. See, look, they don't make it easy on you. <laughs> it's Mike Fulton down in there into the Atlanta. It's Corey Dickerson in Pittsburgh and another 150 years of fun, and it might be my favorite player of all time, certainly one of my top five. It's Teddy Ball Game, folks, Ted Williams. And he's fishing. How about that? He was your last guy to hit 400. It's John Lester, Kevin Pillar, and German Marquez rounding out that pack. Not a spectacular pack, but we did get a Ted Williams, and that's fantastic. 
kids playing baseball, it, it's Ted Williams and Ken Griffey Jr. Watch their swing. It, they're, they're perfect. And they don't get any better. Do what they do, and you'll be just fine. Xander Bogarts. That's a very thick card. Why is that so thick? Something stuck together. It's Derek Rodriguez. Carlos Rodo. And another opening day card. This time it's the Athletics. A nice view from the catcher and umpire's perspective. It's Garrett Cole, Lords Garyell Jr., and another Eugenio Suarez. We have Yadier Molina, mainstay of the Cardinals, a very good player. Francisco Lindor, I'm going to get my big fat thumb out of the way here. It's Jose Leclerc. And another 150 years of fun this time, it is Mike Trout. Talked about him a little bit earlier. I'm telling you, he could, he could go down as the greatest to ever do it. He just might end up the greatest baseball player of all time. It's Shane Bieber. Michael Franco. And Corey Seager. Three more packs left in this box. Once again, I do appreciate you hanging out. Feel free to leave a comment or type something in the chat box. Always open to constructive criticism. And we're going to start this pack off with another Tiger. It's Christian Stewart this time. We haven't seen him yet. Anthony Rendon. We got Adalberto Mondesi. And the Blue Jays mascot. Uh, no name written there. We'll call him. Uh, we won't call him anything. We'll move along. Jeff McNeil. If you got a good name for the, there he is. If you got a good name for the Blue Jays mascot, put it in the chat box, and I'll pass it along to my connections in Toronto. James Paxton and Jorge Polanco to round out that pack. All right. We gotta we gotta get a little momentum here. We gotta start pulling something a little better than what we have so far. And it's Josh James, a highly touted rookie for the Houston Astros. And Matt Kemp, this has him in an LA uniform. He's now in Cincinnati, was in Cincinnati. He's on the move right now, I believe. It's Kristen Yelich, one of two MVPs, current MVPs that the Marlins have let go recently. Shout out to the Derek Jeter-led Marlins. And it's Tom Seaver. Oh, can you see that? Come on, Tom. Tom Seaver was uh, one of my favorites. He spent some time in Cincinnati. He's an absolute stud, certainly one of the top 10 best pitchers of all time. It's Noah Snyder guard again. I think we saw him a little while ago. Justin Smoke and Jamison Talion. And we now come to the last pack of our second box. And it starts off with Raziel Iglesias. Off to a rough start this year, a little bit with Cincinnati Reds. It's Tommy Pham in Tampa Bay, Daniel Polka, and we got another insert. This time it's Kevin Pillar up there in Toronto, making a big catch against the wall. These are pretty cards. I do like them. We're just not getting enough of them. That is our third, I believe. We put him there with John Lester. And Lorenzo Kane. 
we got a team traditions and celebrations. It's the California Spectacular with the Angels. A lot going on on that card. Hopefully, you can pull it into focus. Fire shooting in the sky is always a good time. Derek Dietrich again. And Nicholas Castellanos. That brings us to the end of our second box. Let's get started on the third. Come on. It's Miguel Cabrera. Steven Strasberg. Nolan Arenado. And another opening day this time. It is the Kansas City Royals. And Tuki Toussaint again. We talked about him just a little bit ago. One of the better young prospects in the league. Down in Atlanta. Jose Altuve. And Luis Urias. We'll start this pack off with Rowdy Talese, another rookie. I think we got him earlier. It's Michael Lorenzen, Elvis Andrews, and 150 Years of Fun, Hank Aaron. I think we have that one already as well. Mike Clevenger up in Cleveland, Miles Mikolas again, and Ryan O'Hearn, rated rookie, I think. All those were duplicates we already had. It's Clayton Kershaw one more time. Albert Amora. Jonathan Shoup. And uh, Fred Bird. Redbird the Redbird. And another O'Shea Tani rated rookie. Awesome. Justice Sheffield and Tim Beckham will round out that pack. Chris Bryant, Chris Davis, Paul Goldschmidt, and another 150 years. This one's Gary Carter one more time. We'll speed this up by blasting through uh, some of the duplicates. Trevor Bauer, Kevin Gaussman, and Blake Treman. By the time you hit the third box, I suppose it's... Not out of the question to have a lot of duplicates start popping up. Be real nice to see a few more inserts, some special stuff. Reese Hoskins, Dylan Bundon, pardon me, Dylan Bundy. It's Will Myers, and uh, this is another San Diego Team Traditions card. Whit Merrifield, Robinson Cano, and Jose Barrios. We got Wilson Contreras. And there's a good one. Harrison Bader, rated rookie with your St. Louis Cardinals. Put him in the rookie pile there. Carlos Carrasco. Another 100 years of fun with Nolan Ryan. Brandon Nemo, Michael Kopech, and a Juan Soto. Rated rookie.
It's Ragnar Odor again. Nico Goodrum. Sean Doolittle. And another insert. This time it's Kyle Gibson of the Minnesota Twins. That's our fourth, I believe. And it's Mr. Red, the Cincinnati mascot. We got Chris Archer and Buster Posley. Posey to round out that pack. Salvador Perez. Nick Martini, Starling Castro, and it's Ty Cobb again, Max Muncy, Stephen Piscotti, and Fran Mel Reyes. We got Matt Carpenter, Edwin Encarnacion, and Joey Gallo. Another opening day this time. It is Arizona Diamondbacks. Edwin Diaz, Mitch Garver, and Orlando Arcia. It's Jaime Candelario, Jack Flattery, Flatterer T. We got Justin Turner and 100 Years of Fun Tom Seaver again, Cole Calhoun, Javier Baez, and Ryan Zimmerman. I'm getting near the end here. Well, we got six packs left. Hopefully, we get something good. Something worth talking about in the next few packs here. It's Jacob DeGrom. Brian Anderson. Anthony Rizzo. Paul's your mascot in Detroit. And Ryan Yarbrough, one of the better young pitchers in the Tampa Bay organization. Into the rookie pile with him. It's Jordan Zimmerman and George Springer. Rounding out that pack. Mitch Hanniger. Raphael Devers, and another insert. This time it is Jesus Aguilar. And 150 years of fun this time is Jackie Robinson. Number 42. They wear it every year to honor him, every player in the league, as well they should. Phenomenal player. Broke the color barrier. It's Lorenzo Kane, Tyler Glass now, and a Jake Bowers rookie. Jake Bowers, one of your top 25 prospects in the league, if memory serves me correctly. Brandon Crawford, Trey Mancini, it's Eric Hosmer, and another Team Traditions and Celebrations card. This time it is Detroit. It's the Tiger Merry-Go-Round. 
if you've ever ridden it and you're watching, leave me a comment. Let me know how it is because it looks like fun. I have to stop by next time I'm in Detroit. Gene Shigera. Randall Grichuk. Randall, sorry. And uh, Max Kepler. All right, we're down to three packs left here. Let's get something good. Get something more out of it. Andrelton Simmons, Matt Olson, and another Roland Ronald Okunia Jr. rookie card. That's our third one, I believe. 150 years of fun. This time it's with Derek Jeter. Causing all kinds of trouble down there in Miami right now. Derek Jeter. Almost as good as Barry Larkin. Sandy Alcantara. Alcantara. It's Mark Trumbo and Kenley Jansen. Two more packs to go. Oh, goodness. Two more packs to go here, and then we got our three red parallel packs. It's Glyber Torres. Rookie card. Young kid in New York. Joanne Moncada. Joey Wendell. It's Slider, the mascot up in Cleveland. I think that's a rather unfortunate name, name, Slider. Kyle Tucker, rookie card. It's Zach Grinke and Justin Upton. And that brings us to our very last regular pack here. It's JT Realamuto again. Brad Keller rookie card. Good young arm for the Royals. Williams Astadio rookie card. And it's the Big Hurt again. I believe he was our first 150 year card. He looks like he'll be our last. Ramon Laureano rookie card. Josh Hader in Milwaukee and Felipe Vasquez will round out that box. <clears throat> Pardon me. I'll grab a drink of water here before we get into these last three. All right. So these are the Seven exclusive red paralleled cards inside packs. We have Kaitel Marte, second baseman for the Arizona Diamondbacks. Let's take a quick look at these cards. They are very pretty cards. Very pretty cards indeed. And now, uh, sorry about that. Next, we have Carlos Santana, Jaime Barrea, Shane Bieber. It's Michael Franco, Corey Seeger, and Jeff McNeil. Ah, Jeff McNeil, rookie card. Two more to go. It's a Harrison Bader rated rookie parallel card. Awesome. 
Carlos Carrasco. It's Rugnet Odor's parallel there. We've seen him a few times tonight. Nico Goodrum. Mark Trumbo. Kenley Jansen. And another rookie card. It's Kyle Tucker. And that'll bring us to our last pack here. It's going to start off with Zach Godley. We have Jake Arietta. Mike, my buddy Mike. Mike F. It's Jameis Centalion. Derek Dietrich. We got Nicholas Castellanos and David Price. That's our last card, Mr. David Price. So a little stack of red parallels. Some very pretty cards, no doubt about it. A uh, quick recap. There's a whole bunch of 150-year cards. We have a stack of rookies. I suppose uh, Ronald Acuna Jr. might be our, our best hit there. Uh, Tuki Toussaint. There's some uh, definitely some top 50 players there. Obviously, in baseball, it takes a while to figure out uh, how that's going to shake out. We got three red parallel rookies. We'll put them in the rookie pile. And then our four, five, pardon me, shiny blue inserts. I do like those. Those are pretty cards. And uh, nothing too exciting. We did get, uh, we got a Mike Trout in there. All right. Well, that's it. Uh, no autographs, no um, game used or, or memorabilia cards. And that is certainly disappointing given that we ran through three boxes. But we had a lot of fun doing it, and there are some good cards there. And I love sitting here and chatting about baseball. Uh, we're running just under an hour, uh, so we'll get out of here. But I, I do appreciate it, and if, um, if you want, leave me some comments. Let me know what boxes you would like to see open. I plan on uh, doing some bigger stuff if we can get some folks watching. Uh, follow me on Twitter at Preston underscore sports. I'll be uh, posting there. Uh, before I, I go live, keep you updated on uh, when we're doing and what we're when we're what we are doing and when we are doing it. Pardon me. All right. Again, thanks for stopping by. I am the Preston 13, and remember, kids, Preston loves you.